back to my channel or if you're new here welcome my name is Sam and in today's video I am showing you the latest Light Slacker collection this is our fall collection and it is called Villain Era I really really love the theme and just the branding for this collection as I do with every single collection they just always kill it I was not expecting them to have another like Halloween inspire uh release after the last one we just had but i am very very happy they kept it going because halloween is my favorite holiday i also really enjoy this packaging because it is so sleek and so easy to store so it opens up like this and as you can see we have nail art stickers again they're very very cute and for this time we have six polishes just like all their uh, permanent collections are and I really had to show you this. So this always comes out. I love that they do their packaging very, very like reusable friendly. So this pops up and when you see it here, it has this super cute text. Along with that package, I received two rings from Sio, which is her sister's brand. She has a bunch of different jewelry there. And I've never tried the rings. I got a necklace and also I got my mom a necklace and I really love them. I use them all the time. Well, every time that I actually wear necklaces because I am not a big jewelry person. But these ones are super cool. I really like how chunky this one is and I'm not wearing any other rings, but they're just really, really cool. And now let's just move on to the nail polishes. So the first polish is called Frenemies. Kathleen has been a fan of the H3 podcast for like ever. She always references them and I've never even watched them, but I just kind of have like a soft spot for them because she always talks about them. This is a jelly black polish and it is very, very cool. I feel like it's a lot easier to work with this one than like a regular cream black polish. I don't remember the name of their black polish right now. Is it like tuxedo? Tuxedo mask? I could be lying, but this one is really cool. I don't see myself wearing it that often just because I don't wear black polish, but I feel like it could be good for nail art. sorry not sorry i'm not sure like the exact description just yet but as always i'm going to include them during that swatch portion of the video it's just so like shifty and the shimmer it's kind of like bluish i don't know i don't want to say the wrong thing but this one is one of my favorites and i was very surprised with that because i thought it would be the another one that i will show you in a little bit but this one just looks so so cool i really really liked it it dries a little bit um matte i will say i don't know yeah, I guess like it dries a little bit matte, but after you apply the top coat, it goes super glossy and it just looks a lot more like shifty. I really, really loved it. And I love the name because that's one of my favorite songs. I listen to the song all the time. Like I don't listen to Demi Lovato that often, but when I do, it's this song.
we have a bite me I don't know what's happening with me but I'm just so into the reds lately I really really love this one I love it maybe a little bit more than the one from the previous collection the red from the previous collection which was true blood and I really love true blood I feel like these two together would actually look super cool along with maybe like another maybe like cubana would look pretty with that one and you can just do it like a skittle money right there I really like how shifted this one is it's just super cool and I don't know like you just have to see it for yourself we have unfortunate souls and originally when i got the package and i looked through all of them like very quickly i thought this one would be my favorite and although i really love this one it is not my favorite and i cannot believe that because i am not a red lover like i am really not aside from taylor swift red i really love that one but this one has a very cool finish as well i i see like a little bit of like gold or i don't know it, it looks very very cool especially under different lighting. So let's see the swatches. The next polish is called Anti Hero, and I am so happy that she picked a Taylor Swift song, especially for this color because this whole theme of villains and just like women gaining their power back is so Taylor Swift and this one just reminds me of Reputation the most. I am very very happy with this color. It is a beautiful dark green. It kind of looks like black sometimes because of how deep it is but it just depends on the lighting. I really really love it. I see myself using this a lot out of like all of the shades in this collection. I feel like this one is going to be the one I get the most wear off and yeah i feel like if there's any polish that you will get from this collection i would definitely recommend this one
It's me. I'm <laughs> on the <road> and it's me. <laughs> like I was trying to give it a because you always put some music in. And the next one, it's called Boo You Whore. I thought this polish was going to be like completely different than what it actually was. This is a glow in the dark polish. I have never had any other polishes glow in the dark, so I was very excited to try this out. I went into the bathroom and I tried to record a little video of just like the glowing portion, but I wasn't able to like pick it up with my camera. But I am going to include a picture here so you can see how it actually glows. I don't know how much wear I'm gonna get out of this one, but maybe as a topper it would be cool, especially if you go to like Halloween horror nights or just like for Halloween in general. I think this would be cool to see it like when you're walking around in the dark. I thought it would show a little bit more on the nails by themselves, but it's just kind of like a little bit of a sheen. I decided to do the swatches anyway so you can see how it would look on its own, but like I said, it was kind of hard to record at nighttime, so just this is the picture. <laughs> done with the polishes I wanted to talk a little bit about the nail stickers so I think they match so well with the branding even the packaging has some sort of like this designs and I just think it looks very very cool I know I am very overdue for a like nail art video I feel like every time they do a, a collection I say that I'm going to do a nail art video like quickly after that but it's just been so many things going on, like so much content and not enough time. But I think I'm going to combine this collection with the previous one and just do like one nail art video using those products because I feel like the stickers will pair really well with the other ones. I, I don't know, it's just like really cool, really, really cool vibes. And before we close off the video, I just wanted to give you three recommendations. If you cannot get the whole collection, I would definitely recommend that you get Sorry Not Sorry because it just turned out to be like a very nice surprise for me how much I actually liked it. I thought I would like Fortune Souls the most, but Sorry Not Sorry, it's a really, really good one. Then the next one would be Bite Me because I am in my red era. And lastly, I would recommend Antihero because I am telling you, it's one of the prettiest greens that I have ever seen. It's just so, so cool. And I like the little like um, application. It's just very light and super easy to apply. Okay, everyone, that's everything for this collection. If you're interested in purchasing anything, I'm going to include information on the launch date right here. And I'm also going to include any links or anything that you might need on the description box so you can find them easier. I want to give a huge thank you to Kathleen and Light Slacker for sending this to me on PR. I am always grateful to get this for my channel to be able to review it. If you want to purchase anything from this collection or just in general, you can always use my affiliate code. It is Sam at checkout and you're going to get 10% off. You can also shop through the link on my description box and that helps my channel a lot. So thank you so much if you decide to do so and I'll see you next week for another video. Bye.